Hello, this is Janet. And I'm Joe. With Grow Shop. And welcome to our video series, How to Choose an Electric Motor. We know that selecting the right motor can be a complicated process. Perhaps you're in the early stages of a project that requires a motor, but you aren't sure what type of motor best fits your application. Maybe you're in charge of purchasing motors and you'd like to better understand which specifications are important. Or maybe you're just making sure the motor in your product is the right one for the job. Whatever the case, our primary goal is to help you feel more comfortable selecting motors. By the end of this 10-part video series, you'll have the information and tools needed to feel more confident selecting the optimal motor for your project. Our approach will be to give you background of the motor types as well as help you understand when and why one motor should be used over another. We'll show you how to take advantage of simple modifications to get the best motor for your application. Let's begin with a quick overview of motor basics. In our following videos, we'll look at a checklist of application criteria, discuss the four motor types, their construction, characteristics, advantages and disadvantages, and learn how to interpret performance curves for speed, torque, and efficiency. Finally, to demonstrate the concepts we cover, we'll present a few examples of real-life applications. Be sure to check out the video descriptions for links to downloadable tools that help with the selection process. So Joe, why don't you get us started? Sure, Janet. Let's jump into some motor basics. As you know, the purpose of a motor, regardless of the application, is to change electrical power to mechanical power. No matter the motor type, this power conversion is achieved by inputting an electrical current to create attracting magnetic fields that induce rotation of the shaft. This rotation provides torque to move or hold a load in a wide variety of applications. In AC motors, this rotation happens because of magnetic fields caused by alternating current in the stator coils and the resulting current induced in the rotor. In DC and brushless DC motors, rotation happens when the magnetic field created by the permanent magnets and commutation of the wound coils interact. The purpose of a motor might be straightforward, but actually determining which motor is best for your application can be a challenge. As we'll discover, available input power, application constraints, environmental conditions, and load requirements can all affect the motor's performance. And remember, every application will have its own distinct parameters for input and output power. Keep watching. In our next video, we dive deeper into these application criteria. For more information about GrowShop or any of our products, check out our website at www.growshop.com.